Boys, we are about to add three free gold 99 overall players to the team. Let's talk about it. Now, Soul Soul Say family, and welcome back to another Madden 24 video. Hope you're watching this one. We're having a wonderful start to your day. And without further ado, let's get it popping. Let's get it started. All right, free card number one is something we talked about yesterday on the channel, and it is none other than the free Levante David player item. Right now, this card is a 98 overall for me. We're going to put in our final upgrade token to boost this man from the 92 all the way up to that sweet, sweet 98 overall. And fingers crossed, he turns into a 99. Us personally, we do have a couple little boosts on the card, which might get him there. And bang, a free 99 overall player, 96 speed, 82 strength, 92 zone coverage. Am I going to be using this card on my lineup or sorry, on my John Madden football field? I'm not sure, but he's either way, just an overall filler. And if you're wondering how did I get this card to a 99 overall, I've got a coach in my lineup by the name of Sean McDermott, the coach of the Bills. And by doing so, every single player on my team is getting plus one zone coverage. Now, should I change that? I actually might just because I want to get a coach that will actually benefit the offense and the defense. So maybe we find a coach that has like strength or something or awareness we'll see for the time being though Levante David is boosted to a 99 the way we got him there is simple you get the 92 for free by simply logging into Madden 24 then by playing through the solo challenges as well as the crucible field pass you're gonna get your tokens to boost the guy up to a 98 overall for us he goes to a 99 we love to see it free 99 overall number two numero dos let's talk about another middle linebacker a non-sexy a boring position, but we got another season six 99 overall upgrade token. As you guys can see, this token is going to go into one of the lower overall season six players, which allows you to then boost them up to a gold 99. We already have Lane Johnson starting at the right tackle spot. Drew Brees, unfortunately, is not a good card. Although I will say Drew just had like a commencement speech and he got introduced to the Saints Ring of Honor yesterday. And I almost cried when he had that speech, bro. He, he's my goat. I love that man. Then otherwise, Harrison Smith is an all right player for us personally though we have Bobby Wagner at a 97 and he's about to get boosted up to a 99 overall now this card is actually gonna play on my football field I actually use my middle linebacker in a blitzing role so Bobby Wagner we're gonna put lurk artist on him that's actually gonna be a solid ability and then past that I'm gonna actually put out of my way on this card I don't know that this will activate in the passing game but with the blitz that I put this card on he gets picked up by running backs fairly often I'm not sure if this is gonna work in the passing game or if it only works in the run game and just destroys tight ends as well as running backs in the run game. I'm going to try it. If I don't see it activating, I'll probably switch to Enforcer Supreme, but Bobby Wagner right here. Welcome to the team, brother. You're a gold 99 overall. Again, I think level number 35 is what gave me the token I needed to get this man boosted to a gold 99. And boys, we're making moves. A couple other 99s added to the team. We're getting dangerously close to a full 99 on offense and a full 99 on defense. Only a couple positions on the defense and a couple positions on the offense are left and we're we're gonna get one more right here. All right, now before we talk about the next free 99 in this game, I do have a couple free packs I wanna open up. This one right here is some free coins we're gonna earn from the Infinite Flex promo. We can either take a 97 or we can take, I think it is 40,000 coins. Yeah, 40K coins. Me personally, give me the 40K coins. I don't need a BND 97. We got a 98 overall team. A 97 won't even sniff my field. He would just be a backup, which I don't really need. Then past that, we've got an epic option pack. Let's open this one up and see what we can pull. Probably gonna take the Star Elite. I think the Star Elite is probably your best bet. Pro Max Fantasy is a fun one to open. Past that, the Pro Playmaker and the Playmaker aren't really worth it. The Star Elite Pack is going to give me one high player, which is kind of all I'm looking for. Let's see if we can get someone of value, someone of note. This could be a 97 right here, will it? It's a 95. Not the worst pull. That's probably going to be our only big pull in this pack. 94 Frankie Luvu, actually. I stand corrected. And then a most feared 87 Grady Jarrett. But James Conner right here, I will sell off. That's 50k for free. I'll take it. We get a 94, which is going to be about, what, 30 6k I believe it is for free 33k my bad but either way that's a free almost 90k for free I love to see it and also boys one other tip I want to give you before we pick our final 99 is something I've been seeing a lot of people do to get a free 99 now again this is just going to come down to luck but the 95 plus overall packs I've actually heard are kind of crazy in these solo challenges as you guys can see right here in the obsidian challenges and the regular solos in this promo there's a 95 plus overall BND pack so you're going to get one at tier number eight 
right here a 95 plus overall bnd crucible pack to get that for me i would have to play four more solos which isn't that difficult i'm gonna do that off camera realistically because i've seen a lot of people pull the 99s now if you just play through the regular crucible four solos as well there's a 95 plus overall pack a tier number five and again like i said i've seen that pack be interesting i've seen people pull 99s now again it's a bnd pack but really any of the cards you pull if you get a 99 can probably start for you or probably have a role for you i would say brandon jacobs is the only one where it's like oh do i want to use that card if you pull anyone else like greg jennings sure put him in a wide receiver two put him in a wide receiver three then there's some other cards who i think would absolutely start for you there's the aj terrell who's really really good there's a vince wolfork who's really good there's some solid players who if you happen to get lucky enough and you pull a 99 which again i've seen people doing you're getting a good bit of value and you're getting a good starter okay now next up let's open up the season six set token right here which is what we're going to be opening to get our third free gold 99 overall player in this video boys absolutely zero coins in spend so far and we got a free levante we got a free bobby wagner now it's time to make our choice and pick a free 99 from the season six head pack i cannot lie i am very behind on this but we're going through and we're making our selection anyhow we're going to go to the sets right here we're going to go on over to season number six i don't know why i don't see it in the set okay season pass my mistake now past that i'm opening up the season six 99 overall b n d set player pack let's open this one up let's see what's inside it is a total of 10 reduxes in here i've already kind of looked and seen who's in it but i'm obviously gonna pick a position that i don't have a gold 99 at yet realistically i'm like less concerned with the stats i mean i'm concerned with the stats on these players but i'm not necessarily gonna go through and pick a position that i already have a gold 99 at to upgrade to a better gold 99 no i'm probably gonna look at a position that i don't so cornerback we could take because we don't have a gold 99 at cornerback three tony baselli could work for me stefan diggs could work for me realistically there's quite a few options in here dante culpepper i'm not going to take demarcus ware would be an upgrade at right outside linebacker darren waller i don't think i'm going to take aaron donald is really really freaking good but me personally i already have a bnd nick bosa so i feel like i kind of messed up by taking nick earlier i should have taken the free guard earlier but aaron donald for that reason i kind of have to rule him out although i will say i think he's the best card brian branch is a solid card as well and then Jason Kelsey, again, I already have a free Kevin Mawai. Card's good, but I got free Mawai. Now, for me, this one's coming down to either Demarcus Ware or Tony Baselli. I think that there's other good options in here, but for me, I'm probably just going to take a left tackle that I don't have to touch for the rest of the year. Tony Baselli, I will pick, and I will never have to worry about. He gets good abilities as well. Jalen Johnson's a good card, don't get me wrong. And then Demarcus Ware is a good card, don't get me wrong. But Baselli right now, I think is selling for like 800k on the auction block. That tells tells me all I need to know. That tells me that these offensive linemen, these gold offensive linemen, these gold 99 offensive linemen, they're going to be tough to come by. They're not going to be cheap for the rest of the game. So for me, who is eventually trying to get a gold 99 overall team in this game, picking a card like Tony Baselli is going to mean that I don't have to worry about spending the large amount of coins later down the line to get a gold 99 tackle because these gold 99 offensive linemen, again, they're going to be at a premium. But for me personally, I've got a free right tackle. I've got a right guard who I only had to spend like 250k on to upgrade a free center and a free left tackle that is absolutely awesome in terms of abilities right here secure protector for one it is worth spending the one ap on that i'll probably also go edge protector edge protector i think is what i want to rock here i believe i already have a linchpin i don't even know that that really works and then all day i'm not sure if it's better than edge i'll go with edge but if the comment section tells me all day is better hey i'll make that change and this team is looking pretty end game hope you guys have enjoyed today's video here is the updated squad let me know what you guys think I think it's actually in a pretty good situation for no money spent. If you enjoyed today's video, leave a like down below. And until next time, I'm out. Love y'all. See y'all. Peace.